guys, welcome back to Shay's Way. Today I am going to be riding Rocket and I'm having a little fun, exciting thing. So I don't know if you guys know, but there's a singer and influencer called Lauren Gray. I'm going to be joining her Zoom concert tonight. So I'm like excited about that. I will vlog it for you guys. Can't wait. Yeah. So we are going to do some poles lesson on Rocket today. It's our pole day. We're going to do a little exercise. It's so much fun. I'm excited. We'll see how good Rocket will be. Okay, let's just go get on. What's up? We are now on Rocket and here we are just doing our hack, doing our thing. Rocket was pretty good in the hack. He was just kind of chilling and his mane is getting so long. Like it's just like really long. He looks like a Mustang. It's like spirit. We stand it for him, but we kind of want a shorter mane because it's just getting everywhere, you know, but he's really, really cute anyway. So today we are doing poles, which is like exercises kind of with like round poles and it helps your horse come back to you. And it also helps like when you're jumping, it's just like, it's an extra step. It's like a conditioning, it's a training, you know, when you do like workout exercises, when you're in a sport, it's like that. But for horses, we stand that. So we just started off doing like the rows of poles that you see me doing here. And it was like a straight one to a bending one. And that's really good because it helps your horse keep a round bend shape, especially with the bending poles. And so I had to keep him kind of like collected and like forward at the same time. And that one we messed up on. So he kind of like jumped the last two, but we fixed it and he was very good. So you want to get your horse going like forward enough, but also contained to where they kind of step over all the poles and they don't like run through them or kick them or anything like that. You want each their like legs like individually step over the poles. And then we went down this whole line as well and it was pretty good. Rocket was being very good so far. It was like, all right, I'm ready for this lifestyle. And we liked the bending pole line a lot. It was a lot of fun, especially when I got it like right. It felt like really bouncy and fun. And poles can be like really bouncy feeling. Like they feel like, I don't know, like a trampoline pony. It's just fun to do it. Then we stepped it up and we brought Rocket up to a canter. And this is where things get hard because this is where you have to know like your strides. And if you don't get the strides right, then he like will break to a trot in the middle of the poles. And it's just never a fun time. So we started off with our first pole line, just getting him to the right strides. And then we went off into the little bending one. And Rocket liked the bending one a lot. And I had a hard time for some reason figuring out what strides were in between the poles. I kept like counting them wrong. It was really weird but I got it eventually. But here I am like, I'm just like guessing at this point. And then um, I finally got it like around here. Actually, no, here is where he was getting a little speedy and we had to like bring him back and make sure we got it. And then we got him nicely there. Like you can see in the first one, his head's like down a little bit more. And then in that one, his head was up a bit more. And then we put them together and we started off with just the bending to the straight and then going around and not doing like the full thing yet because we wanted to make sure that we got it nice and good, no running off into it. And Rocket was being very, very good. This way was a lot easier than the other direction, which we'll get to in a little bit. <laughs> I make a lot of mistakes, but for some reason our left lead was easier than our right lead today, which was really weird, but... You know, this is how Rocket feeling, yo. And then we went down the whole line and Rocket was very, very good about it. He was like, all right, I'm cool with it. I'm chill. Yeah. After doing it again, it was time to switch to the other direction and this was just not going well. I kept like getting the wrong strides and then Rocket would like trot in the middle and then I would like try to pick up the canner and just like gallop through that one it was a disaster then they didn't go to that pole so then i tried it again and i just still kind of messed it up and flubbed it so then we decided to like not go through it because it was just a mess then attempt number three a little better in the beginning and then i completely lost my strides like here i was like Ugh. but then i still kept going and then this one was just a mess i was like trotting through it so then we tried it again and it was still a mess <laughs> and I was like, okay, let me just try to do it again. And then that one was okay. Oh yeah, that one was okay too. So it was just like the first one was a little bit of a mess. And then we finally got it. So here's us like doing it right. And it wasn't completely perfect. As you can see, we kind of trotted that one too. But then we got the canter back up. 
And then this one was even better. We, I don't think we tried it in this one. See? Yeah, this one was better. I still didn't have my strides completely good in the middle, but the bending was pretty good. Oh, and then we messed up again. So then we tried it again. And then we added a little bit more. So we got it finally in the middle. And then we like we got the whole thing. So that was good. And then we added something to the end of it. So you'll see in a sec. But we did this line like really good. And then we went around the corner. And we jumped like a short jump. So it was kind of like a pole slash cavaletti size jump stay. And it was pretty lit. Rocket was really good down that line. And then we jumped another one. So he was really good up that one as well. And then we went back through it again just to like clean up everything. Because there was a little bit of like messiness in there. And this one was way better. And you guys can see it looks a little more aesthetically pleasing to watch. And then we got this line like better too, like we came in deep, but it was a good kind of deep, like it was like a scrambly kind of deep. And then we jumped this one and we added even more to it. This was fun. So we had to go back down the line and for some reason, I'm better down the line than I am up the line. So you'll see this goes pretty well. Rocket was like, yes sir, I shall do it. I'm a good boy, yeah. And then we had to go up the diagonal and take this one at kind of like an angle almost and then turn around and get our bending line again. And Rocket was perfect. So I was like really proud of him. And that was pretty much all we did for the lesson. That was it. We did our pulls and Rocket was really good. We had to work through some issues where he was a little harder to get to get like the right distance with but finally we got it after like a lot of attempts so if you guys are ever struggling with not getting the distance you want just keep going for it keep trying different things and you'll eventually get it yo guys i just got home i got the mail and stuff and now i'm gonna go get ready for the zoom call with lauren anyway um now that i'm home Let's go change. Let's go get pretty. Get ready with me. Okay, let's go my outfit. It's like really freaking cold, so I'm gonna wear sweats, but this is like really cute sweats. And then I have this matching top that goes with it. So let's get into that. So I'm waiting to join, and I just found out. Well, I didn't just find out. I forgot that it was started at five and not six. For some reason, like they had it at six and then they changed it to five. And I thought it changed from five to six. Okay, I'm joining in. I'm joining in. I'm getting in though. So I'm doing all right. Do you have any questions? Um, yeah, I wanted to. Excited to get it out there. The turnaround time was actually real, actually really fast. We recorded, um, and then the song came out a couple weeks later. So here I am joining the Zoom call, and there was like over 278 people. Like there was a lot of people on it, and I was like, whoa. So it was kind of turned out to be a Q and A sesh, and like. She looks so adorable, like, hello. But um, it was not a concert. I thought it was going to be a concert for some reason. I don't know why. But still, it was a lot of fun. And there's me. I'm chilling. Okay, that was pretty much it. <laughs> Let me tell you guys, like, what happened. So, um, I was, like, really late. But I joined. And then it just, I thought it was going to be a concert. But it wasn't. It was a, just a virtual meet and greet. And there was, like, over, like, 200 people. Like, there was, like, the highest was, like, 272, I think. Or, like, maybe even more. But there was, like, a lot of people. And they were just kind of answering, answering questions. And I can't say too much about it. But I've uh, been in a Gazoo meeting with Lauren with, like, 13 people. And I asked questions already. So I was, like, I'll just, like chill stay a little bit and then i had to like go because i have like homework and i was thought it was gonna be a concert so i was like come down for the concert thing but then like i like kind of all the questions were like questions that like were asked already so i was like i'm gonna dip a little bit but it was still fun and yeah and i'm super excited that i got that opportunity so pretty chill anyway guys that's about it this is like my day i just like rode rocket and then i had a little fun zoom meeting with lauren gray wait let me switch different camera. Anyway, you guys, that's it for this video. If you liked it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Also, don't forget to ring the bell because then you get notified when I post. I have merch, so go check out my merch links down below. They're super cute. You won't regret it. And now, let's do some video shoutouts. Shout out to Millie Star Stable. Shout out to Elbray. Shout out to Nicole O'Brien. Shout out to It's Layla Rose. Shout out to Soed Idris. Shout out to Sydney Faults. Shout out to Wolf. Shout out to Chris E. Shout out to Zephyr Plays. Shout out to Peyton Equestrian. Shout out to Heidi Cameron. 
Shout out to Addison DeMarco. Shout out to Breezy2009. Shout out to Estelle Dorval. Shout out to Kiara Davos. And last shout out goes to Adriana and Willow. If you guys want to be the next video's video shout out, then don't forget to comment on this video or any of my other videos. Or you can comment on my Instagram, Shaysway Official. TikTok, Shay and Rocket. Twitter, Shaysway Slays. And Facebook, Shaysway. Okay, thank you guys again so much for watching. Have a great day! Okay, bye!